What's up YouTube, it's Dom Universe. Today I wanted to make this video real quick to spread awareness because I know I like to help people raise their consciousness, uh, raise their awareness on themselves and help better themselves and learn their true power. But I've been kind of straying away from important topics, which I think I should get back into doing because I have a lot of knowledge on this stuff and this stuff is important like to your life and to your reincarnating to your reincarnation and you having to come back and it's a lot going on around this planet that we don't see on the physical level so as y'all know this planet is ran by satan this planet this dirt this third dimension is ran by satan oh shit I almost fell off but uh as you know or should know we are in a spiritual battle with not just with ourselves, but with its demons all around this planet not just in the spiritual realm around you now first off you got to know something the demonic spirits that's around all over the planet they're here they are jealous of humans they're jealous of humans and if you don't know, people like people who are on, on this planet with angelic genes, people who like to help people, people with pure hearts, they shine bright. They have a brightness to them. And this is what attracts dark spirits as well. So if you if you notice people who are mostly kind, they are they're kind hearted, they're soft hearted. So they easy to hurt if they have if they don't have the right self discipline and have the right pieces of knowledge or whatever. But these are the people who are likely to get hurt, right? They have a, a light to them. And this is what make this also makes them vulnerable to dark spirits if they don't have the right, if they not equipped with the right knowledge, spiritual knowledge. They get attacked. That is one that is one uh instance of a spiritual battle, right? Then you have the demonic entities that live on this planet inside of the earth right there are different layers on in the earth there are different layers in the inner earth and we know our government they have tunnels to go down there right so remember we are create they are we created by um reptilian humanoids right but there are different type of reptilian races of extraterrestrials that live on this planet and y'all know our and y'all know our government work with them right they've been working with them we've been through this for, for decades, they've been working with them for, for years. So, take this in. We have reptilian humanoids that live on the earth that are responsible for a lot of the shit that's going on on this planet. You have also inside of uh, inner earth called what's called insectoids. These are insect-like creatures. They show you all of this in movies because you, when remember, a TV is a black mirror with just with images even with the tv on it's still a black mirror and you're gazing into it it has all your attention everything else outside of the tv when you uh looking at the tv it don't matter when it got your attention you giving it your energy you letting it absorb your energy so you're gazing into it you're gazing into it and what does that mean you are in a meditative state at that at that point you are in a flow state a state of concentration focus which means you are using your currency your energy they throw everything in your face they throw it all in your face they they don't give up they just throw it in your face and these these days they've been getting bold with it it's starting to be more and more heavy evidence that they throw in in our face excuse me so i say all this to say we need to start raising our vibration now we need to start getting crystals to protect our aura or help protect our aura. We have to strengthen our aura by raising our vibration, taking care of ourselves and not eating bullshit meat and whatnot. Y'all know meat gives you insects. I don't care what meat you eat. You have insects. I don't care what. I don't care. You have insects. Bro, these flies be wilding back here. But yeah, you, you have insects. I, I don't care what how you feel about it. I don't care if it's grass-fed meat. It's meat. 
It's it, even if it's fish. Now, what I'm what I'm getting at is so take this for exist example, right? We know our government is bullshit. You know they have underground bunkers. So the government that we have up here is not shit. They don't matter. That's why they say people that's why they be saying people who are who have power like like the president or the sinisters or or any of these political people that be on TV in the suits who who be who got big names. These people are are just puppets. That's why they say they puppets. You know why? Because we have something called a shadow government that lives underground that control all this bullshit that happened up here that's taking place and affecting us negatively like 5G. 5G is cancerous. It has carn carn uh carnagens in it. Y'all know carnages, car carcinogens. Carcinogens cause cancer. It's a low vibrating frequency. Frequency, it, and it moves slow. It's a frequency you're not supposed to feel. People are, people who have five G phones right now. What what they going through is things like the the five G is altering their body temperatures, making their testicles hurt giving them up making their veins protrude through their body giving them headaches things like that making their testicles hot uh people 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 having mood swings people getting tired and lazy out of nowhere that's that's just one instance 5g then you got these forest fires all these all these woodlands that's burning around especially in california then you got brazil which brazil's uh amazonian forest is it's been on fire for i think 16 how the fuck is, is a, a forest on fire for 16 days what the fuck uh, what 16 days on fire listen i just want to say amazon the amazon is an important civil one of the most important civilizations on this planet that's where our ancestors were that's one of the places our ancestors were there are pyramids in at the Amazon. That lets you know it even just just by it being pyramids there lets you know it's an important civilization. But that's not the only reason that is important. You got to do your research on the Amazon, the Amazonians. Not only that, Amazonians were is where the Titans were. There were Titans, although it was Titans everywhere. There were a lot of Titans inhabiting Amazon. The Amazonian rainforest. They trying to. They've been trying to destroy the Amazon. They've been trying to. They've been trying to. You know they've been trying to. They've been trying to blow up pyramids, and they cannot. They cannot blow up fucking pyramids because pyramids were not created by fucking humans, right? Now they got the uh, the rainforest out there being being on fire for 16 days. They've been trying to destroy the fucking Amazon. Then you got then you then you got the 5G killing animals. I already talked about all the the thousands of birds in all these different states being found dead. All the all the fish being found in all these lakes all over the planet, all over the uh, United States. All these fish being found. Thousands of animals dropping dead, not just because of 5G. But that plays a big role in it. And then you got stuff like like them polluting the fucking air. You gotta you gotta think. You gotta think. They doing all this bullshit to us. For what? When you raise your frequency, none of this shit can affect you. When you raise your vibration, none of this shit can affect you. When you when you rate now listen. Raising your vibration can protect you from it can protect you from 5G. Strengthening your aura can protect you from 5G. But I will also recommend getting crystals like black tourmaline or tourmaline period or oregon, oregon, oregonite. Get an oregonite period, a uh, pyramid or an uh, oregon pyramid. These protect you from 5G. You have to raise your frequency. This is important. You have to raise your frequency. I will make a video on how to uh many ways to raise your frequency but do not wait or just take my advice on raising frequency it's many ways to raise your frequency do listen take care of yourself 
they 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 want to see us go down they want to bring us down with them these people who are doing things like this under the ground the the shadow government they are vibrating at a low frequency now insectoids we talked about dimensions right now let's talk about insects the insectoids that live under the ground they they are extraterrestrial oh and not only that we have gray grays underground grays are not very good aliens i'm not gonna say it's not no good ones but most of these gray aliens are parasites they're parasites i think they came from the dark side of the moon whatever planet it was they came from the dark side of this planet you can and the with the arcturians then i think they came from the same planet as the arcturians arcturian no re reticulin 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 i forgot their whole name but they call it reticulins these are the good grays but then you have the gray aliens they but anyway they have these all these extraterrestrial beings underground controlling everything that's going on up here if you look at Brazil, the Brazilian, uh, it was a, it was an alien invasion in Brazil. They depicted this on the movie Signs, where the city was going fucking insane. They was they was running around, scattering. The whole crowd was scattering, but somebody happened to record, or 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 report that they saw this reptilian humanoid being walking past the buildings. And if you look at the movie signs, that reticulin humanoid, I mean reptilian humanoid, that one, that's reptilian and reticulin are not the same. But reptilian, they saw a reptilian humanoid. This thing walks on two feet. It has a body just like ours. It just looks like a fucking reptile. They saw this in Brazil. These when they when people say and they seeing aliens and whatnot, and they they fucking recording it. Oftentimes it get dismissed and call a hoax or fake when all this shit that's happening is real. These like it's proof all over the internet of all this shit, but somehow it's getting dismissed and called a hoax. And it's just it's just wild out here. It's not something you should fear. Don't fear it. But then you got also got things like like them putting fluoride in our water and trying to make make us think that since, since we drinking it we also cleaning our teeth with it that's fucking bullshit because it fucks up your brain it it it, decal it calcifies your pineal gland it makes you fucking retarded what else they are going to try to force the rfid chip i've been new about rfid chip since 2012 i've been into this shit i've been studying this shit they've been trying to get this RFID chip into people. I heard they doing it in Europe. I heard they doing it in China. I heard they doing it in I think uh I know they doing it in some places here in America. But the whole agenda for that was the whole propaganda for them bringing the IFD RFID chips was to make uh money non-valuable so that we didn't have to use money. In the Bible it says if you get the mark of the beast in your hand or your forehead, you're getting sent to you're you're going to be damned to eternal damnation condemned to eternal damnation but that chip that we we have the chip in our fucking debit cards now right but it, it's a smaller version i know y'all saw kid boo get that chip in his hand that chip in your hand or head is supposed to represent the mark of the beast but fuck that we are already the beast but that that mark of the beast that that how do i say that breaks the deal that that makes you since you making a physical object for something that don't matter a part of your body inside your body you are you are making yourself a part of this planet you are weighing your heart now i'm not gonna say that necessarily affects your heart but that makes you a part that makes basically you making yourself a robot because what that rfid chip inside your skin supposed to do is when you walk into stores you can just scan you can just scan without using money no money no car you can just scan you can scan your fucking head scan your hand you walk in take what you want and pay for it just with your chip inside your hand i heard that if if and they can track you with these chips and if you did a certain something or they they spying on you and they see you doing something they can release some type of fucking toxin 
out of the fucking uh RFID chip. And then they got fucking FEMA camps. I'm here in Walmart. If you if you switch the fucking words around, it stands for martial law. I've been hearing that Walmart is a fucking FEMA camp. It's concentration camps because they got WalMarts out here all over the planet that that got suspicious activity going inside of them. It's even one here where I live that used to be a Walmart. They turned this into a building. And nobody even know what the fuck is in that building. Nobody knows what that building is. That Walmart got closed, I think, over ten years ago. It it was the most convenient Walmart, but now it's it's some type of building. Nobody. It looks like a plant, but there is never any cars in the driveway like that. Maybe you see trucks. I don't know what they're doing in there. I'm not saying it's a concentration camp, but I don't know what's going in it, going on in there. You, it's a lot of stuff going on around around the planet that we don't see with our physical eyes, but it's going on. See, this is why famous people call the public stupid. Be, and this is why other countries think fucking Americans are stupid because we get things thrown in our face and we get shit happening to us and we don't act on it. We don't do anything. People don't do anything about the shit that's happening. Like, like all the shit that's going on in this planet, in in America. Why hasn't why hasn't people marched like how they did for that Black Lives Matter thing, where all the people was in the street and people was getting late to work because it was big old crowds of people. Why ain't we doing that to the White House? Why ain't we doing that to Area Fifty One? There was people saying that people were going to have to raid. Area 51 way before this Area 51 bullshit been popping online. People been saying this way before that. Now, I don't know how serious this Area 51 bullshit is, but if they going, I would take weapons. I would take weapons. Because right now, it's time people, it's time we get answers. Like, let's say we ran, ran up to the White House. It's not necessarily much that the people in the White House could do if we was to run up on them. But because they are not the ones who run this shit. We don't see the people who run this shit. Think about, think about like Illuminati, right? It's supposed to be a secret organization and people think that the political people are in the Illuminati and really the, it's a secret society, right? You're not supposed to know about a secret society, right? So let's say, let's say Illuminati is a fraud and the people that the political people on the TV and whatnot, excuse me, they, the politicians, they, let's say they are Illuminati. Illuminati, that would make Illuminati a fucking distraction. Look at the callus on my hand from working out. But yeah, uh, that would make the Illuminati a distraction. You have other societies underground that's not even fucking human. They're not human. Like, why? Listen, think about this. Why do they want to? Why does Bill Gates want to block off the sun? Because take this in. Most European people have no soul. You see the you see the amount of uh, melanin in my skin, right? Most humans have melanin, right? Melanin, an, an amount of darkness in their skin. Most Europeans don't have that because of the bloodline they come from. Now these 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 Europeans, these white devils as people call them, the Caucasoids, they, and I'm not saying. Listen, there are some Caucasoids with a soul. I want y'all to know that. And you can get a soul if you don't have one. Bill Gates wants to block off the sun. Why the fuck would you want to block off the sun? See, the whites, the Caucasoids can't take the sun. And you know when the second, when that sun shoot that solar flare, when it's time for that second sun to come, or when that sun shoot that solar flare, if you're not living, if you if you melanated and your blood is not alkaline, or if you are a, a Caucasoid, you are going to be vulnerable to spontaneous combustion, and you're you you can catch on fire out of nowhere. You can catch on fire out of no fucking where. Uh. But yeah, the uh, melanin is the amount of pigmentation. Your melanin is your soul. Your melanin is your soul. So what is what is black? Black is not necessarily a color, but it's something filled, but void at the same time. Then you have white. What is white? Something with the absence of color. So this is why Negroids are called colored and whites are not really, they're not colored. So they don't have no soul. They don't have a fucking soul. This is why they say gingers, gingers, the pale skin, red hair kids, 
have no soul because they have pheomelanin. Pheomelanin, if you in the sun, they they are spont they are uh vulnerable to cancer from the sun. They are vulnerable to cancer from the fucking sun. That that whole gingers don't have a soul thing, that's partially true. It's partially true. That that whole thing is not fake. It's not bullshit. Remember, look up the uh the the uh y'all gotta know the history of races. I already made a video on that about Yakub, the comedic scientist who who came and genetically spliced his uh DNA with fucking rept with the Neanderthals and created the first Caucasoid. He is not he is not an Anunnaki god, so he wasn't supposed to do that. That is why the human came out as a Caucasoid. The Anunnaki. Are the only people who can do that now when you see now you got humans on this planet trying to mix human DNA with animals these days especially Japan and China Japan and China are mixing fucking human DNA with animals we can't breathe with you we can't breathe with no species of animal so the only way they can do that is gene splicing which is against the fucking laws of the universe and what does that mean when you're going against the laws of the universe you are you are doing Freemason activity. Freemason activity. And then look at the gay stuff. Look at the gay stuff, right? No, nothing against gays. I love gay people. I love gay people. I love almost all LGP. I don't give a fuck what you label yourself. I love you. But let's look at gays. The gay homosexuality was brought here by the Greeks. Practiced by the Greeks. Not saying that there was no, no homosexuality in other... Uh, civilizations but there isn't much evidence of it but it comes from greece the europeans the ones with the backwards knowledge of our ancestors now take this in these people the greek the that's a thick ass caterpillar but anyway the greeks right what was i saying these people uh I don't even remember what I was saying, but just know though. The Greeks, uh, when this happened, this shit be getting me tight when I be forgetting what I be saying. I, I just be all over the place with my information, but just know though. Uh, you also look at the Germans. The Germans are responsible for us even knowing how to speak English. Because the Germans came here, they didn't create the English language, but they came and forced it on the Americans, and that is why we speak this cursed language. Remember, communicate language is the lowest form of communication. The lowest form of communication. We came from telepathy. We came from tele communicating with telepathy. What do you, what do you think is called telecommunicating when you're talking on the phone for? Why do you think it's called that? Because when you on the phone, you are you are un, you are subconsciously learning how to communicate telepathically through the phone, re reading energy through energy through just a voice. Yeah, you just talking, but you are learning how to use energy through the fucking phone. It's tough out here, but they yeah they. Oh yeah, what I was trying to say was Yeah, but the Europeans Most of the Europeans have no soul You got Bill Gates trying to block off the sun Just just stuff like that Like what, what are you going to block off the sun for? You, you, he, they know they're going to go through spontaneous combustion These people are going to have to go underground When that second sun comes Or when the sun shoots a solar flare in a couple years I'm gonna get more into these uh these topics because we are actually in the end times right now and this this is valuable information. This is information you cannot get from religion. If you part of religion, that's letting you know right there. You are conforming to society standards. Why would you want to do what everybody else is doing? Just think about that. You are programming yourself. You look like a fucking robot.
But that's pretty much it. I love y'all. Dime Universe taking off. Peace.